Here we're going to solve the equation for the missing matrix. So we have an understanding that n is going to be a matrix, and it looks like negative 4 has been multiplied by n, suggesting that we have scalar multiplication right here. And when we did this scalar multiplication, this is the matrix that we ended up with, this 2 by 3 matrix. Okay, so since I know that n has been multiplied by negative 4, I need to go through and divide both sides by negative 4 to get rid of this multiplication. Or, and probably a little easier with matrices, I'm going to multiply both sides by a negative 1 fourth. So on the left over here, my negatives will cancel, my 4's will cancel, and I'm left with just n. So n equals, and it's going to be this uh, 2 by 3 matrix, and this one needs to be scaled by a negative 1 fourth to kind of undo the scaling that happened on the left side where I multiplied n by negative 4. So I'm going to go through and divide every term by 4 and then essentially change the sign of it. So when I multiply by negative 1 fourth, change the sign, divided by 4. So 16, first entry. I'm going to change the sign to negative and I'm going to divide it by 4. So negative 4. Negative 24, when I multiply by a negative, the negative goes away, becomes a positive, and 24 divided by 4 is 6. 4 times a negative 1 fourth, so we change the sign, divide by 4, so I'm going to get negative 1. So down here, this last row, negative 8 times negative 1 fourth, change the sign, divide by 4, so positive 2. 20. Change the sign, divide by 4 is negative 5. And 32, change the sign, divide by 4 will be negative 8. So this n matrix here, this uh, 2 by 3 matrix that represents n, is going to be the solution for this matrix equation.